let's do some math. So here I have some frogs and we're going to count the frogs and then we're going to write the number of frogs that are there. Now on this first one, I have a little pattern that you can follow just in case you're still learning how to write your numbers. Then we're going to do it where they're blank. We'll count again and then we'll write the numbers all by ourselves without tracing. All right, let's begin. Here are my crayons. I don't know. I think I'll pick this blue to work with. All right, I want you to count along with me as I touch each frog. Let's begin. One, two, three, four. There are four frogs right here. Raise your hand if you're four. Four is your number. Your hand should be in the air. We're going to go straight down, slide to the right, cut it in half. All right. Now remember, on these worksheets, they're on the website, so your adult can print these off and you can follow along with me. Or you can just watch me if you'd like. Let's count these frogs. One, two. Two frogs on this row. Here we go. Up and around, come down, slide to the right. That's kind of a fancy two with that loop in there. I'll show you how I make my twos on the next worksheet. Here we go. Let's count this row right here. One, two, three. Are you counting with me? Let's do it again. One, two, three. Raise your hand if you're three. Anybody three? Then this is your number. Around and around. This one also has a fancy loop on it. Oh, there's a whole bunch of frogs right here. Let's count them together. I hope we can count this high. One, two, three, four, five, and six. The number six. Around like an oval and bring it in tight. Around like an oval and bring it in tight. The number six and six frogs. How many frogs are in this section? You're right, just one. One cute little frog. Straight down. This one has a little slant on it and a line across the bottom. Fancy as well. Just a minute, I'm going to show you how I make mine. It's much more simple than that. Let's count these little guys. Here we go, our very last section. One, two, three, four, and five. Straight down, my favorite number to write. In fact, raise your hand if you're five. Five is such a great number. Straight down, out and around, put on his hat. Straight down, out and around, put on his hat. Okay, let's move these over here and get the second page, our second worksheet, we don't have anything to trace. We're going to write them all by ourselves. Here we go, counting together. One, two, three, four. Let's write a four. Straight down, slide to the right, cut him in half. The number four. Count the next ones. One, two. This is how I make my two not quite as fancy as the last one. Up and around, slant down, slide to the right. Numbers, oop, I won't tell you what number this is. Let's count this. One, two, three. I almost said it first. Out and around, out and around. The number three. Let's count this section right here. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Come around like we're making an oval and bring it in tight. The number six. How many are in this section? <laughs> You're right, just one. I just go straight down for my one. Is that how you make your one? Just straight down. And last section, one, two, three, four, and five. One of my favorite numbers. Straight down, out and around, put on his hat. Good job! We did it! Well done!